Good day, y'all. Well, I'm glad to be back on my motorcycle. I'm taking a trip today. Most of you know, last year on my uh, ride in Colorado, I had uh, fractured my upper tibia and tore my ACL and meniscus. So I had my surgery, and I'm recovering well and back to riding again on my bike. So anyways, today I'm riding to Solomon's Castle with Golf Coast Motorcycle. They uh, have a, an event every Sunday. They do shop rides uh, and today happens to be going to some castle. So I really like uh, dealing with uh, Golf Coast Motorcycles like a family uh, shop. I mean you can walk in there and uh, they know your name. If I walked in any other place even if I bought a motorcycle from them they would never know who I am again. So I really enjoy them. And uh, you know, it's just a great place. I go there Saturdays. They have a grill going, and they do bratwurst and hamburgers, and the guys sit around and tell war stories about their motorcycle rides and all the places they've been. And it's just great. A lot of fun. So, but anyways, I'm just glad to be riding again. So I'm off to the uh, little diner um, where we're meeting at, and uh, it's in right by Alba. So I'm almost there so once we get there uh, we'll meet with the guys and then we'll take off for a ride so come along and I hope you enjoy it thanks so one of the first things you notice when you get to the Alva Country Diner is these trees they're just gorgeous they hang over the parking lot really neat had to take a couple of pictures of them so here's the crew, some of them at least, and we're ready to take off. Everybody's getting lined up. Alright, here we go. Got all kinds of riders, different bikes. There's a Harley, there's a, the Crotch Rockets, the touring bikes, a few adventure bikes. You see all kinds. Great bunch of guys. So, Webb's in the front there, he's the uh, sales rep. Golf Coast Motorcycles and he's leading the way, so off we go. So we're riding over the river here and heading right into the little small town of Alva. And, uh, and from there, taking some of the back roads to get to the castle. It's actually not too far of a ride, but um, we're just going roundabout ways to get there, uh, making the ride a lot longer. Um, just a nice ride. It's a beautiful day. Uh, as you can see, the sun's out. It's not too hot. Um, not raining or anything. Um, just a gorgeous day. Here's just typical Florida back road uh, that you'll you'll run into. You know, pretty straight, not a lot of hills, not a whole lot of twists and turns. You know, pretty straight. We actually did hit some. I'll call them moguls. They are called hills here. Um, but actually hit a few of those on the way out, which is kind of cool. It kind of surprises you because you're riding so flat all the time, and then all of a sudden, bumpity bump. But anyways, it was pretty much like this the ride out there but uh, it's still beautiful you know and um, just a great ride with a great group of people uh, you know what more can you ask for so we had a blast and uh, I said this is typical Florida roads here so at least where I'm at so what good is it if you don't do a motorcycle selfie so this is my version of a selfie like this. Enjoy that. I think you want to see pictures of me, but anyway, you can see some of the guys in the back there coming up. And there goes my evil twin. So I can see what I look like riding. Different riding suit, but same bike and everything. That's my buddy Sergio. Uh, he did a Colorado ride also. So it's just nice, and we're cruising along. Everybody's just, you know, staying in a tight little pack here. 
maybe not so tight, but going probably around 50, 55 miles an hour. So everybody's just cruising, you know, enjoying their time. Uh, whoa, maybe not all of us are cruising. Okay, this is a town of Arcadia. Um, big old truck with oranges on it. Of course, everything out here is uh, the orange, oranges. Um, this town's really cool. I like it. It's just like it seems like a throwback to time. Everything's uh, you know older. It's really cool. I love going there and taking pictures. I've got a, a ton of pictures that I took from there. Let's get some neat pictures. Um, this town's right right before we get to. Uh, to Solomon's uh, Castle. So, um, back here we are. We're pulling in now to Solomon's Castle. Um, so this was a great ride. And it's still beautiful weather. Pulling into the parking lot. And that's Webb in front of me. He's the sales rep. And those are the people that were speeding. They beat us there. So this is Solomon's Castle, and it was uh, designed and built by Howard Solomon. Uh, it houses his home and galleries and a lot of his sculptures. Very cool, and they have a nice little restaurant there to eat. And We all had a blast. We all ate and fat and happy and started heading back out. So here I have my GoPro mounted on the back. Uh, it's one of my videos I had. And believe it or not, I actually uh, broke it. One of the pieces wasn't glued in from my demo video. Anyways, it worked. So here we're passing some Harley guys. They were just kind of cruising, enjoying themselves, and Sergio and I were kind of flying back. So we're passing them on the uh, left here. And if you notice, uh, up in the front, I don't know why, the leader of this group, he decided he didn't want us passing. He pulled over into the lane and kind of blocked Sergio. Sergio has a big old bullhorn, of course, and blew it, and scared the crap out of that guy so he gave him the friendly one finger how do you do wave and we went by them and I was hoping I wouldn't run out of gas and meet these guys again. I guess he didn't like